<laughs> Look at those wild and crazy people sliding down the hill on their butt. We traversed until we felt we had the, the most gentle slope and it's steep. I mean, you really get going. And then down we went. Susan beat me by about eight feet. I was putting the brakes on the whole time. Susan, she was just letting it go. Oh my gosh, that was so fun. That's pretty fun stuff right there. Yeah. You're never too old. Never too old. Hiking is happiness. Look at this. This glacial valley. We're up on top of this rock. The glacier left. Look at all the rocks in the snow that have fallen down through the winter. This is really amazing. I mean, it is amazing. So fun. That little stream, we can hear it quite well. I mean, I'd love to, I just would love to come back and go climb up through that valley and go drink from those lakes down there and just experience everything there is to experience up here. And Susan and I were just talking about, we're not even going to leave this valley in two days of exploring. We won't even leave this valley and we're going to see so much. It is so cool. Live well. We are. You know, one of the cool things is when you come up in a situation like this, you look back on where you were and you have the thoughts of what it was like and, oh my gosh, and how are we going to get up there? And here we are looking back down on that. So that little arrowhead piece of real estate down there, we were standing on that looking up here. There's our ridge we climbed up. It was a little bit touch and go on that ridge, but Susan made it. Then we had a really steep section coming up that we can't see of snow. Then over there we had lunch. Susan got a little uh, altitude sickness right at the base of that rock, that rock mound right there. So a half hour of uh, water, breathing, a little stinger, and she felt a lot better. We climbed up that ridge down the other side to see the valley. And then we're making our way down this ridge. So we're going to go up here. We're going to follow this ridge down, cross the snow into that little meadow. I see part of the trail. But we're going to, instead of going that way, we're going to come back. And then we'll finish our hike up this little valley exactly the same way we came. Or at least that's our plan. If we change it, guess what? You'll be the first to know. <laughs> You'll be the first to know. Okay, well, maybe the second to know. We'll be the first to know, right, Susan? That's right. Come on, let's go. Join us. It's about time. Look at this. One thirty, two o'clock. We've just changed our plan a little bit. We're going to go down this ridge. We're going to go down this little slope, down to that water. We'll probably fill our water there up, our, our water jugs up. Then we're going to go around, and we're going to cross the snow to that little saddle. That saddle is, we should be able to see the Chambers Lakes. They're right over there. So we'll be able to see that. Then we won't go down. We'll just get there. And then we'll come back down and work our way around and down we go. So that's our plan. We're going to extend our time up here. Susan wants to see the Chambers Lakes. And we'll put nap time off just a little bit. And we'll take a look at that. Because we're here. You know, why not? Another hour and we get to see so much more. So come with. Let's go explore. Let's find out what's around the next bit. We dumped out the water we brought. <laughs> <laughs> it smells, it tastes like smoke from uh, Foley Ridge anyway. So we take, we dump that out.
a little bit more. Obviously, I'm not going to go out <laughs> and sink in the slush. That doesn't make sense. So I went to where the slush is just on the edge. I'm right on the edge of the slush. Dug a little hole, filtered water. Out there, I'd be wet. Back here, I'm good. Happiness is hiking at 60. Here's to you. Cheers. <sighs> Cheers. Oh, that's good water. Yeah, that's good. Ice cold. Yummy. Look at the color. Just gorgeous. This is what living's all about, people. That's what it's all about. Come and join One of the things I think is really cool is look at all the shorelines. See the variation of the, where the water, uh, temp, the depth of the water. See, it has all these different shorelines. See that one up there? As it fluctuates up and down through the season, different uh, heights of water shoreline that's that's pretty high up there that's this baby's pretty full after maybe all this melts this uh, water will increase the lake will get deeper pond will get deeper pretty cool stuff you know, the things you run into as you kind of hike along, we're just taking it easy today. We're just enjoying ourselves. That white rock right there is pumice. It floats. So the shoreline as it, uh, you know, comes up here, it lifts all this light rock up, pumice, and deposits it right on the shore. That's so cool. We're just having a heck of a time. Susan, I want to hear it. I love this more than Garth. Yeah. Come on. It's apples and oranges. It's not even the same. Susan, she won't. She That's won't admit no it. She comparison. won't admit this is better than Garth Brooks. <laughs> Damn. That was an amazing weekend. Too. Oh my lord! Last weekend, she's still on cloud nine over Garth Brooks. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, fine. Okay, fine. Garth, Garth wouldn't give her the time of day. And she's still in love with Garth, but look at this. It's two different comparisons. You can't even compare the two. Susan's a great rationalizer. No. <laughs> she's rationalizing. Because this is pretty that. awesome. Look at this snowdrift, people. Look at this snowdrift. If that's 40 feet high, I don't know what is. It's got to be 40 feet tall. Snowdrift. Pretty awesome stuff. I won't bore you with this part, but we're going to head up here and take a look at Chambers Lake. I'll see you on the other side. Jared, this is for you, my friend. We climbed up on the other side all the way up on those hills back there we came down into this valley got water hiked up the snow up this drift which is immense and now we're looking at chambers lake just like you wanted to see 
We, we wish you'd have been with us today, Jared. We had a great day. The two chambers lakes. This is in between South Sister and Middle Sister. Awesome. Amazing. So this is for you, my friend. I think you should come join us sometime, Jared. Honestly, it was just a beautiful, beautiful day today. No bugs. Well, one bug. First thing this morning, I got bit by a bug on my wrist. There's the red spot, swelled up a little bit. Susan, thank goodness, Susan said, well, you better put something on that. And I did. I put a alcohol wipe on it, and it really kind of helped it out. That bug sure got, got a good piece of me. Yeah, well, this is good stuff, people. Pretty amazing. And, you know, I mean, yeah, yesterday was not easy. Yesterday was 7 miles, 1,800 feet, 2 miles through snow with our packs. It was hard, but today sure made up for it. Today has just been amazing. We have so enjoyed this. So enjoyed this. We've enjoyed bringing it to you. Oregon is amazing. We love Oregon. But there's lots of places that are amazing, that are worth exploring. July 5th, 2019. We climbed all the way up through in there. We hiked up that ridge. Ridge is only about three feet wide at the top, two feet wide. There were some sketchy moments. There were some times that Susan was a little bit on the, well, really? But she did it. She did it. In that little depression right there in front of us is that little lit lake. There's a fall. We can see part of that other lake right back over there already. You can still see it. So there's camp. That's where we're headed. There's our camp. There's home. Susan and I have had a really amazing day. We haven't pushed it at all. We go a hundred feet and we stop. We take pictures, shoot some video, talk about what we see, how beautiful it is, how happy we are. We walk another couple hundred feet, we do the same thing. We are just thoroughly enjoying the day. All the things we run into. Everything that's just, I mean like this group of rocks right here, it's just like, Amazing. This all is just happening. It's so cool to run into this. We are very lucky. Very lucky. Check out the pattern of the snow. Is that cool or what? That's where Susan and I went up. We went right up that snow. Made our way up. 
What a what a great adventure, eh, Susan? What a great adventure. Yeah, it was a great adventure. So we're following somebody came down here and that's their tracks right there. And you can't see them, but they're down there near our camp heading heading out. They may have a camp. But uh wow. So cool. That's where we were, right up there. We hiked those ridges. So fun. We're glad that you've taken the time to watch this video, spend some time with us. A like would be much appreciated. You could subscribe. And more than any other thing really is, is uh, share. You may know somebody that would really enjoy our videos. Share with us, share with them. We'd like to inspire people to get out and do things. It's our impetus for being here, so let's do it together. And drag your poles. Dig your feet in. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you were going. Oh my gosh, I was going fast. You were. It seemed Ooh. a lot faster than really. From here, it looked like you were in total control. Oh, that was fun. Oh my goodness. Good for you. <laughs> okay. Our grand finale coming down the hill. Here's our stripes to prove it. We got on our butts and slid down the this mountain. We're like little kids. Oh, it was so much like fun. Kids. So much fun coming down there. You'll see the video, I'm sure. <laughs> oh, what a great day. We have had so much fun up here in the mountains.